Hey there, I'm Brent Harvey with A-Hole Productions and today is Motivational Monday. Oh yeah, your favorite day of the week. So, what I want to talk about today is success versus failure. Yet again, our society has taught us incorrectly. It has taught us that success is good, failure is bad. So don't fail. Go out there and succeed, succeed, succeed. However, the problem with that is you cannot succeed without, you guessed it, failure. Failure and success go hand in hand. And failure is better than success because you do not learn from success. You learn from failures, right? Think about it. When we were kids, right, before we were conscious of our egos and all that other stuff and worried about what other people thought, before we could walk, we were crawling. We were trying to walk. We would get up, we'd fall down, fail. We'd get up, we'd fall down, fail. And that went on forever. We would do it over and over and over again. We wouldn't, we wouldn't walk that day and then we go to sleep, we get up, we'd try to do it all over again. Some of us even tried to run before we walked. We failed a lot. But through the failures where we learned how to adjust our bodies, our neurological system, built the pathways it needed to understand so that we could walk. Same thing with talking. We didn't just start speaking clearly. Even like myself, I still don't. The problem is, is that we put success so high up. We want to succeed. We want people to think of us, uh, us as successful, you know, financially, uh, romantically, whatever it is, that we don't leave room for failure. So if you're succeeding all the time, you're not trying hard enough. Because if you're really trying, you'd be failing really hard. And here's, here's the reality to it. The harder you fail, the more you succeed. Win big, play big. You've heard that before, right? So, if you want to succeed more, and I cannot remember who said this right now, but there's a great quote by someone who said, you know the secret to success is if you want to succeed faster, fail faster. You want to succeed bigger, fail bigger. Because that's where the success comes in. And there is no real true failure because if you take everything that doesn't work out as a lesson, then it's a success. If you look at Edison inventing the light bulb, he said it's been, you've heard this before. He didn't say I failed a thousand times at, you know, uh, at making the light bulb. I just learned a thousand ways that didn't work. But it took all those thousand ways for him to discover the way that it did work. He, it, it was a process of elimination. See, stop looking at life as a success-failure thing. Think of it like a scientist. It's an experiment. Let's see what happens when. Embrace failure. Embrace it and, and bring it closer to you than success. Because if you haven't realized it yet in your life, life is about experiences. It's about discovering what's possible. And if you live within limitations, and there's many different types of limitations we'll talk about in other videos, but if you live in limitation, especially the limitation of thinking that you have to succeed all the time, guess what? You're not gonna reach your full potential in life. You're not gonna reach the level of success or your dreams that you say you wanna achieve. Because if you're, if you're afraid to fail, then you're afraid to succeed. So my challenge to you this week and on beyond that is to embrace failure crash the plane because thinking about that when a plane crashes as tragic as that is we learn something from it oh now we know what wind shear is or we know that we that a plane can or can't do this and we fix it why is plane air air travel so safe nowadays because we learn from everything that failed and we fixed it so you should be grateful there were failures because that's why you can sleep on the plane and not fear it crashing because it's failed in the past. They learned from it. They applied it and moved forward. Our whole society, you look at the world, everything has been designed, was designed through failure. All the innovation, everything. Things had to fail in order for us to learn lessons to succeed. Embrace it. There's nothing wrong with it. And if anybody makes fun of you or judges you for it, they're just afraid to go after it. So, go out there, do what you do, be willing to be fearless, and fail big time. And I guarantee you, you'll win big time. 
apply the lessons. And as my father once told me, if you learn from it, it's not a mistake. It's a lesson. All right? So go out there, start failing more. Quit trying to succeed. Fail bigger and you'll win. All right? As always, our goal at A-Hole Productions is to inspire others in the global artistic community. So if you like this information or you think it's valuable to someone else, friend, family, or maybe an enemy, send it to them. Like it below. Share it with as many people because our goal is to inspire others to follow their dreams and do great things in the world. And don't forget that if you have a question or comment, please leave it below. We will answer it. We'll get back to it because you never know. Somebody else might have the same thought or question, but they're just afraid to ask because they're afraid to fail, as we just talked about. All right? So until next time, remember, being an a-hole is a good thing.